Welcome back to the channel. It's your host Rob with i25 Kia. It's a new year, so that means we're gonna be talking about some new cars. And with me today, I have the 2020 Sorento EX. So let's go over some of the features with this guy because it is SUV season. You need some all wheel drive traction for those adventures ahead. On the exterior of this guy, you're gonna get these 19 inch black alloy wheels. Those are super cool looking. Most of the front elements have not been redesigned for 2020, but you do have these projector beam fog lights. You're gonna have the signature tiger nose grill, except this one's going to be a gloss paint job on it. Still looks really cool. Comes with this very nice key fob. You can simply hold down the button. You have your smart lift gate. I haven't programmed it yet, but you can have the key in your pocket and simply just walk up for 10 seconds or so and it'll just lift on its own because it's smart. So now let's hop inside because it's really cold outside. Why does it have to be so cold every, every single new year? Oh, January, that's why. Well, let's hop on in. All right, just like every single Sorento you hop into, the first thing you're gonna notice is how much space you have. You have ample headroom. I'm six foot tall and I've still got another foot up here, I think. Maybe not a foot. But you've also got three rows of seating, but you're also gonna notice how comfortable it is inside. You've got full leather seat trim on the entire vehicle. Very comfortable seats. Uh, the driver's seat has a 10-way adjustable seat. So you can really get this vehicle to fit like a glove. Let's turn this puppy on. You got a push button start. The seven inch touchscreen display comes with the integrated Apple CarPlay, the Android Auto, the Bluetooth connectivity, but the Apple CarPlay is super sweet and you can navigate through all your phone calls, through your music, and through your maps. And what I really like about the maps is if you already have a destination that you were using in your phone, this is automatically gonna take you there or try to navigate you there. It's just very intuitive. It, there's not many opportunities for you to be distracted and it's really just a seamless installation. Also gonna be where you're gonna find your backup camera. This thing does have the dynamic bending lines so that you can navigate in reverse really easily. This thing also has rear cross traffic alerts. So if there's any obstacles coming from the left or the right, the car is gonna let you know and then you won't hit that. And it also has a parking distance warning so you'll hear that little beep if you're getting too close to something. All these features just make it really easy to navigate. And now back to the interior, you have this gigantic panoramic sunroof that just goes to the end of the earth, really. It's so big, you can't get over it. So great feature for the summertime, or actually today. I mean, it's cold outside, but having a little bit of fresh air coming through the top, it's nice. But let's say I'm really cold. Then I just hop over to my heated seats. So you've got heated seats for the driver and the passenger and both of you guys have three different modes. So you can have a really hot butt, a semi-hot butt, and then a warm butt, and then a cold butt. All right, buckle in. Let's take this thing for a test drive and talk about some of the features this guy has in terms of performance. When you first start driving in the Sorento, you're quickly gonna notice how smooth the handling is. It really just glides. Everything about this car is very responsive. The handling's very responsive, the gas is responsive, and if you need it more responsive, then you have separate drive modes. You can go to Eco, you can go to Smart, you can go to Comfort, or Sport. And Sport's gonna make your gas pedal a little bit more responsive and it's gonna tighten up this wheel for you. I buckled you in for safety, but you don't need to be too safe because this is already a very safe vehicle. The Sorento comes with blind spot collision avoidance, so if you're trying to switch lanes and there's somebody in the lane next to you, the car is gonna alert to you that you shouldn't do that. And to complement that feature, you also have the lane keep assist. So as long as you have the two lines in front of you, the tech in this car is gonna try its best to keep you in the lines. You've got the rear cross traffic alert, like I already said for when you're backing up. You also have auto emergency braking, which is a phenomenal feature to have if you're doing a lot of commuting on the interstates or the highways especially when you hit construction. You have a very nice smart cruise control system where you can customize the distance between the car in front of you. And you also have the smart cruise control with the stop and go, which is pretty sweet. You have a Sportsmatic Sport Shifter with an eight speed automatic transmission with an electronically controlled eight speed automatic transmission complemented by a 3.3 liter V6 engine. You're never gonna have a hard time getting into fast traffic or going up mountains. It's a great all-wheel drive vehicle packed with power and comfort. 
The second row has a 40-20-40 split seat, and then the third row has a 50-50 split back seat. So there's many different ways for you to load the gear that you need to load. I mean, essentially, you can turn this into a truck back there. If you guys have any further questions about the 2020 Sorento EX or any Kia vehicle, go talk to the car experts at I-25 Kia. Check back soon for more content and have a great day. Happy New Year. Bye.